Well, this news came from the manufacturers of the Merlin helicopter, Augusta Westland. They found that during an inspection on an Italian Navy Merlin, corrosion was found in some of the bolts on the airframe, specifically in the tail rotor control system. They couldn't be any more specific than that, but they did say they issued a service bulletin to all users of the Merlin right across the world, including the British military here at places like Royal Naval Air Station Yeovilton. Indeed, Augusta Westland told me that the Royal Navy were very keen to look at their own airframes. Augusta Westland has said, please inspect your aircraft within a month. The Royal Navy decided that they would look at each Merlin, look at these bolts in the tail rotor control system before each airframe next took to the sky. So that is what I assume has been taking place here. And Augustas tell me that the Royal Navy inspections so far have found no evidence of similar corrosion. Well, the MOD have responded to this, issuing a statement a short time ago, which reads as follows. A technical issue has been identified by Augusta Westland whilst conducting maintenance on an Italian Merlin aircraft. The Royal Navy Joint Helicopter Command, Commando Helicopter Force, operate a similar variant of the Merlin and for safety and assurance reasons, a maintenance check is being conducted across the fleet. Now, the MOD also told me that the aircraft have not been grounded, but that they are being checked and they expect them to return to normal operations once the maintenance check has been conducted. There have been no injuries or incidents, the MOD tell me, uh, because of this issue. The Merlin has been in service, uh, first thing service incidentally in Bosnia, served also most recently in Afghanistan, a very capable airframe and the Royal Navy are recently and have been recently and are continuing to take over more of the Merlin from the RAF for their ongoing flying operations. Tim Cooper, Forces News, Royal Naval Air Station, Yeovilton.